Welcome to Katie's Funeral Part 2. <laughs> awesome. Katie has... We thought she died last week. No, no, no. She died. Just you wait. Just, <laughs> Supergirl Woo! 606 was like, hold my snacks, hold my beer. Like, yeah. Get exactly. ready. Gosh, mm. I can't. They said hold my glasses. Yeah, li- literally. No. Oh my gosh. Okay. Wait, also, is my internet okay or should I try and switch or what's it looks fine to me. Okay, great. Perfect. Never mind. It's working for me. <laughs> it looks fine for me, so okay. Good. okay. good enough. Good enough for me. This episode. <laughs> Welcome to episode six oh six of Supergirl where Come we are talking again. all about everything that happened in Prom again. That's what it was called. Yeah, prom again. Who we got dressed up for the occasion? Cause you know. Yeah, we did. We, we did. did. We got the little bow tie, Katie stunning dress, which I fuck with that dress. Like it is stunning. Thanks. Just like Thanks. Nia in, I really... in the ship. Like. You know what? Let me tell you something first. <laughs> Immediately, when the very like last shot of the episode where they're like laying back and it's like whatever like blasting off into whatever um nia's like laying back like this and i was like girl nicole mange chose violence with that neckline (laughs) are you kidding me you expect literally you expect me to not look right there like and you got a whole ma'am no (laughs) <laughs> her, her one last episode did too but like she chose she really chose violence with this one like this dress oh my gosh <laughs> mm-hmm. stunning I mean like I saw so the photo pretty. last week when you showed me the screen just but it did not do it justice seeing it like in mm. the I was oh like oh my gosh step on me I like I will die for you we will die for her anyways but like I was like True. you can yeah she's yeah. Brittany's reaction was 100% like me, like stunning. Like, yeah. Oh my gosh. It's so gorgeous. cute. And then we got into the dance. Oh, the dance on the ship, please. The w- There's just so. It's the way she rests her head on him for me. Literally, that was, that was the cutest thing. I was just like, this is like. You were really, you really just got a three course meal. Like, you, they really were just like, I let, know. Me, let, let me Woo! feed Katie. Like, let me feed you all the food on this damn ship. Like, literally. Yeah. Like, they said buffet. And you know what? Like, that's all you can eat, girl. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh. Like, between this episode and last episode, like, I don't even know what to do with myself. <laughs> like, like well, I how really do you- just see how do like, you recover from that? That's why they, they're going on hiatus after next don't. week. So you can recover for the next three months. That's true. That <laughs> like, is this is true. too much for Katie. Let's just go on hiatus for like three see months. See you in August. Yeah. Yeah, oh like see you in Lidrid. Gosh. No, honestly, you're probably, yeah. No, they're like, the, the people won't be able to handle this. We got to give them a minute. By a minute, like three months. But like, Lidrid. you know, whatever. Just, oh I God. mean, makes sense. This episode was just, it was like the perfect, Ugh. like, like um, part two to like the story. Like, it was just the perfect like conclusion to the whole time travel story. It was just, yeah. Oh, it just didn't miss. Like, this episode did not miss. Like, yeah. Did I think better than part one? Probably. I think I preferred it more than part one. I don't know, actually. Me too. I think I liked it. I don't They're both so good. Yeah. It was, I don't know. Oh. I just hope the quality oh, like no. this stays is, for the rest of the show. I know. I know. I'm, I'm so praying. scared. We like can't let our guards down. Like we cannot let our guards down about this season because like every episode we're like, it was really good. Don't mess it up. Don't do it. <laughs> Cause, mm. Oh, because we know they can and they're fully capable. I know. I, told you, um, I, I can't trust but, them. I, just be spoken about. I can't trust them. But did you see the screen in the, 
in the side side track again in the promo for next week. Did you see Lena's hand on on Nia? Like it was like yeah, like almost like Lena protecting her child like the Sora. Love that. Uh, it was just like this is what I want. Oh like I want God. this content. Yeah, yeah. They really Please. gave that to us. Like that's one of my favorite parts of this show. Like one of my favorite things is like the Danvers sisters, but like I mean I guess Kara especially because she's had more scenes with her. Just like being like the protective like don't touch my daughter to Nia like yeah. I just uh, that's one of my favorite things I just love that concept <laughs> but and now we got everybody doing it now literally every female character is like don't don't <laughs> you're gonna have to go through me I'm like <sighs> as they should as they should because it's yeah. about time people is pr- start protecting Nia let's be honest she is yeah precious. yeah okay a long overdue <laughs> You're right. Literally. Oh my gosh. And like, <laughs> oh, I can't. I just loved it. This season, like, I just really need everybody that dropped the show to like pick it back up <laughs> with this season. Honestly, like, just let's I can give people if they don't if they don't want to watch season five because I know that it's they're gonna struggle. I will give you a list of mm-hmm. episodes to catch up. Like all you gotta do yeah. is probably maybe watch the first well, watch five A. That was like decent, yeah. I feel. Watch the 100th mm-hmm. episode, obviously. And if you yeah. love Nia, watch the Nia-centric episode, which you should be doing anyway. Maybe watch mm-hmm. the Alex. And the Alex. One. And the Alex. Yeah. It has her, her and Callie. That's it. And then the finale. Oh, you know what? The finale. Yeah, finale yeah. was good. That's really, oh that's what, maybe 10 episodes out of the 20. Like, that's half the season. Like, I got you. Yeah. That's like, easy. It's fine. Whatever. And if you don't want that, then just watch We're the, just like, yeah, please, like, we're begging you. Just don't bother season five but season six <laughs> see yeah oh literally the weakest episode in season six was episode two but it wasn't even that bad yeah like, yeah even, like Ka- it was katie, like fine was, yeah Ka- katie carried that let's be honest katie carried that but like mm-hmm. yeah, yeah that was really good yeah like it wasn't like uh like that one skip it like yeah. i wouldn't skip it like yeah, it i wouldn't skip so like, if you if you had to rank it if you had to rank the episodes, yeah, it would be on the bottom yeah. for me. Not for a bad reason, mm-hmm. but like every other episode has just been incredible. Better, yeah, yeah. yeah. But it's the way the writers knew. Okay, this episode's mediocre. Let's just have Katie looking hot as fuck, and like it's fine. Like the episode just uh, Katie makes. Yeah. She, I tell, I'm telling you, like yeah. it is what it is. Is that is. that's the one where she walks into the courtroom, right? Yeah, 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 like, yeah, yeah. Everyone get out of my way. Oh, yeah, I'm just like that boss like queen, please. Oh, oh I love that was so her. iconic. Oh, yeah. So fun. we're getting her back next week. Thank goodness. I know. Um there but... was did you see the little um teaser? There oh there was a BTS that Staz posted, but he deleted it. But obviously this fandom mm-hmm. screenshot it. It was him, Lena, yeah. and Kara. And I'm like, okay. It's like BTS with these badass ladies, and it was like Lena and Kara. And then he was like in the background. I'm just like, what is happening for them three to be working together? I'm like, oh, I'm stressed. Like, yeah. Give me that. That's true. Oof, I was like, hello. Like, Lena put him in his place. I would love that, <laughs> honestly. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> no, exactly. Yeah. She's like, so you think you're good enough for Kara, huh? Like, oh, literally, please. like, please. Oh. Push him off the cliff. I don't That'd care. So I support the queen. Like, it's fine. Yeah. No, it'd be so good. Oh my gosh. But also while we're talking about sort of BTS, but not really, Guardian Kelly, the official pictures came yes, out. Yes, the way, let me just get it up on my phone so I can show it in the video. Cause like this woman, yeah. Ozzy just really was like, I'm going to drop this photo before, before, you know, the Game Night Crew records. That, you know, just, yeah. because, just because, like she really was like, let me give this yeah. podcast something to talk about extra today. You know, yeah. she had a feeling. She was like, hmm, somebody's recording something important today. Like, okay. uh, ignore the ring light, but like, please. And it, look, it's very no, bad it's quality on, on the camera, but it's fine. She looks. You get it. Beautiful. Go look at it and go like the picture yourself because. Oh, exactly. Oh my God. It is so good. But here's the sucky thing is that we're not getting it until after the break confirmed basically which is just that is unfortunate <laughs> exactly but because mm, it should have been this episode where she saves the watchtower headquarters whatever yes but, that's mm, what i'm fun. manifesting next week that's what but does Cal- i'm not i still don't know if kelly is going with them to the phantom zone 
Yeah, that's I don't true. Know if that was confirmed. I, I just doubt them because I don't know. Because she's not like one of the superhero people yet. But I guess Molina well, will probably go. So. Well, Yelena yeah, was with Nia in the ship. Lena right? transcends to superhero. <laughs> <laughs> Lena's superpower is her brain. Okay, that's her. Like, that's, that's, yeah, that. yeah. She is a genius. Oh, yeah. She literally solved nine percent of their problems in season six. I swear to God. So that's true. That is but, true. Um, she looks phenomenal. Ozzy looks so good. Like I'm standing. <sighs> oh my god! More than I thought possible. Like she. I know phenomenal. the braids. Like, yes. Like, I love them. I just I love them. so long overdue, but like I'm glad that and it's the episode that she yeah. uh, is writing, actually co co wrote. Yeah. Which is just even more iconic. Mm-hmm. She, it's cause like twins when do Can you imagine co-write. writing your own superhero? Honestly. Like, who's doing it like her? Nobody. Literally nobody. Exactly. Like Literally honestly. Exactly. And I'm pretty sure oh. that David Ramsey is he's directing, but I think he's actually got a guest yeah. star in it as he's actually guest starring in it as well. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. So uh, like, there's gonna cool. be a whole. I'm here for like honestly, the whole episode is just Callie and Alex, and like I'm here. What? A, yeah. Give it to. I'm just, for it. Let them do like, it. Do it. Don't be shy. Yeah. Like I'm. Yeah. In, in here for that. That's all I'm saying. Oh my gosh, the Kelly centric episode, please. Episode like, twelve is gonna come oh, from. Like I cannot wait. It's yeah. airing. It's gonna, it's gonna air September twenty first, I think, and I'm like, oh, that's so far mm-hmm. away like stress yeah but it's gonna be so worth far it. What the it's heck? worth it for her worth it for but her. like it is just a tad suspicious again i don't want to get my hopes up but like it's just a tad suspicious that there are it's episode 12 out of 20 and we're adding a new superhero in i'm just saying mm. what could that mean for the future Shh, do you not even manifest anything yet because i am Guardian Kelly spin off. Hey, honestly, Gosh. we need that. They won't. We need that. I know they won't do it, but like we need it. They won't do it. So but I heard there's a rumor going around that they are thinking about doing. I heard this through somebody else, so I don't really know how true this is. But they said that there's a rumor going around that they are like testing the waters for um, how receptive people would be for a Midvale spin off. Do okay. it. That's what I'm saying. I mean, yeah, do 100%. it. <laughs> do it. They're so good. Those actresses, like, really deserve that. I'm like, honestly, just... I'm here for it. And then I can even yeah. cast the young Lena to like make an appearance, and like, I'm here for it. I told you. Mm-hmm. I don't yeah. Know, just do something. I don't care. <laughs> like, do. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know. Like... <laughs> I love the attitude of just just do something. I don't care. Like, whatever. Like, do literally anything. Yeah. That sounds about right. Oh my gosh. So good. Please. Anything. Literally anything. How's it going? Are you here? You're here. Yes. yes. Okay. Sorry. Hi. It's okay. Uh, I was waiting for it to it's fine. I thought it was freezing and I was like, hold on a second, then it's fine. Ah. Uh, okay, okay. Hey, we had technical difficulties as always. We're Love that for us. Have... It's fine, it's fine. It's fine. We're back, we're back, we're back. It's fine. Yeah. Um So the episode. Okay, so back to the episode. Funny. Because like Yeah, episode. We, we always so, it's fine. I think the viewers are used to this now. It's fine. Like, we talk like... Yeah. It's like 10% episode, talking about the episode, 90% of, like, everything else. Yeah. It's we fine. say one line about the episode, and we go, but wait, <laughs> hold on, speaking of... <laughs> literally. <laughs> literally. Um, <laughs> so, Gosh, back, to, back to Brainier being iconic. Um, can, we, can we just talk about Nia and her powers this week? Because, oh my god. Though it was the first moment was when she within um she was trying to save uh who was it was a Kara and she she's like uh, at the beginning and she goes like that like she just like walks yeah uh, she's like strutting herself like, <gasps> and I'm like okay girl the like okay power the, oh, the, power she, she can hit me with one of her dream bubbles and I'll be like hit me again girl let's go yeah like, I'd be like <laughs> oh no oh my gosh here we go. <laughs> He's just oh, and even though her visions and like her manifesting her pa- her the dreams to reality. Oh, <gasps> bitch, are you kidding me? Like that's the most iconic thing I've ever seen. Honestly, the most, like, are you kidding me? Like she literally, first of all, just like stopped the cougar in its tracks, like from pouncing on her in the dream, 
yeah. then took the cougar from the dream. And oh, don't even don't mess with me. Don't mess with me. It's she's just, just it. She just she, is it. She is like she can be. Is she the strongest after Kara? Pro- pro- most likely. Let's be. Uh, we're gonna spill facts. Like she's really becoming powerful. Like yeah. It's, like her potential is. Ooh. She's getting a little scary. <laughs> Honestly, like, even Brain is like, did you just do that? Like what? He's like, yeah. oh. He's like, that's my wife. Be. That's my future wife. Like, mm-hmm. come on yeah he's just so literally and that. even the little when she like knocked Kara out i was like oh, oh. like she's literally yeah. getting five powers an episode at this point yeah. and even, i love that even like let's when keep she, doing it she shot the little dream arrow at the 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 drone yeah the drone. Oh my I'm, like, she <laughs> is just, I'm like okay she just is they're really just like developing these powers so well i'm like first of all we needed this in last mm-hmm. season but it's fine um yep. but I'm yeah. glad that she actually doesn't walk. But even though they're doing it now, it doesn't, it's still, it doesn't actually feel rushed. I still feel like it's still feeling, like, natural, which is good, because I don't want it to be, like, yeah. rushed, like, you know. But she's, Yeah, I don't want them just, like, throwing random powers at her and being like, yeah, wow, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. crazy. Mm. Um, and I got that she kind so of far. got... To, yeah, I like how she kind of got to discover, like, she was trying to interpret her dreams. And I, I like that, yes, yeah, she actually like, she wanted to call her mom, but, like, she couldn't, like, it, it was mm-hmm. you know she couldn't but like she figured out on her own like brainy had she had brain support obviously but like you know she just she did it on her own i'm just like that's growth there that is growth yeah right yeah i did want her to call her mom but like that same yeah yeah no. it's good for her it's good for her that she was like she's able to do it herself and like ugh. yeah i yeah. want mm-hmm. she's just so powerful like no, that's my I, baby right there. Let's see if I can keep up her, her how powerful she is for the rest of the season. That's what I yeah. want. Yeah. Because, like, there's no point giving her all these amazing powers if you're not going to, like, you know, show them and utilize them more. Yeah. Yeah. So, who knows? Again, we can't let our guard down. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Because she's going to no, have to use them all. Do you, maybe yeah. she had to develop them in these two episodes because in the next one, She's gonna have to use, mm. you, you know, in the Phantom, she's gonna have to use her. What yeah. is that? That sonar thing to like track her or yeah. track her or something. Oh, that was so crazy. What the heck? Yeah. Yeah. So, like, it's gonna be interesting. But whatever. The, I'm before, so excited for the next episode. Like, Me t- it's I'm gonna so be a, a doozy. Like, I can just tell, like, that it's from the be- plot. Yeah. I do. Oh. I just don't. I know it's the mid season finale. And I don't know if they planned for that to actually be the mid-season finale because like i think they were originally mm-hmm. going to have like the entire run of episode without a break maybe uh, because they had to push it maybe. back in this time you know because yeah the person on hiatus they made this but i'm hoping there's no cliffhanger i really hope by the end kara comes back because i think episode eight is called welcome back kara or welcome home kara i uh, think so i'm hoping <laughs> so she'll be back in episode eight but i'm hoping she like we actually get to save her and it's like a cute little happy mm-hmm. ending ish for now. In yeah. Because I don't want to, yeah, I, I don't want to get a cliffhanger. I, <laughs> I know. know the way, like the, the only cliffhanger I'll accept is if Supercorp acknowledges their feelings. That's the only cliffhanger I'll accept, but it's not going to happen because I'm a clown. It's fine. I accept that's that. Just... But like, <laughs> that's, it's listen. fine. I don't care. You're I start... right. Yeah. I'm not dealing with another cliffhanger. I'm sorry. No, like it, and they, I, I feel like they, I feel like we're gonna save her at like the very last second of the episode or something. Maybe yeah, yeah, it better it, not be because I want to see the reunion. Yeah. Like yeah, if we well, don't get to see everybody hug her, like yeah, 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 hundred percent. I feel that. I just, I don't know. Mm-hmm. I just because I know that Katie, as we said, Katie teased. I said this last time, like Katie teased the reunion. So I'm hoping mm-hmm. it's at the end of seven. And then, like, mm-hmm. episode eight is like, I don't know. I'm just, I can't trust the writers. I'm so, I, I'm, I'm, I can't trust them. I know. Stress. I know. I can't trust them. <laughs> I yeah. know. Every episode, we're like, it's really good. Or watch it. <laughs> Literally. Watch I can't it trust you. I can't Are trust them until I see it for myself. But I whatever happens, I don't know. Oh, whatever. Yeah. It's, the preview it's, looks so good, though. Yeah, it does. Oh my gosh. Uh, Alex gonna... like fell out of 
something. Like, yeah. I don't remember yeah. what it was. <laughs> well, is it, is it because remember the... they go they go to like look at their fears or they they um live their darkest fears or something. So like, yeah, who the hell knows what each person's fear could be? I swear, if Lena's fear has to do with Kara, I swear to God, I'll be just like, fuck you all. Fuck you all. Yeah. It won't, because I, I, it won't, <laughs> but, like, imagine. <laughs> I feel like hers would probably be something to do with, like, everyone viewing her as, like... Yeah, that's what I think. Whatever, like, something like that. Yeah, probably. that's what I think. But I feel like we've made so much progression that we, don't, we know that... I just feel like she needs yeah. to talk to Kara and, like, acknowledge, you know, because she couldn't... She can't be fully... Katie said she can't be herself fully until she speaks to Kara and let's make sure Kara knows that, you know, she didn't mean to because she still feels like it's her fault that she got trapped in the phantom. Yeah. Time. So, like, until yeah. she has a conversation with Kara, if I swear, if they do some emotional shit in the phantom zone, I'm going to combust. I'm going to actually combust. That's fine. But, like, they better, though. Like, what the Honestly, heck? Like, I, I <laughs> want Lena. So, you know how Kara was, like, seeing visions or whatever she was, she was seeing, like, well, yeah. she was seeing the worst things that could happen, to, right? To her friends and everything mm-hmm. when her eyes are like that right that's what they said like she was really big yeah she was reliving her worst fears or something that's what yeah mm-hmm. and like i think it's getting worse and worse can you imagine if lena puts herself in harm's way and like is protecting kara from what's her name mix uh nixley and it's like yeah. i will in actually yeah in girl i will literally not be okay <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh. She's not gone. What if that's the cliffhanger? If like she just like Oh, uh, if she's like alive, I'll be like that will be fine. Cause like I'll like I know she's alive. She's not yeah. gonna be dead. She's fine. It's I think. I don't know. I think so too, yeah. Um, I think she's gonna be that villain of next season. I mean that could be I'm here for and it. it could be Lex, but no, yeah, but I don't want it to be Lex. I'm over it. I know. It's been such a blessing without him in it for the last three weeks. I've been loving it. I've been loving <laughs> Sorry, it. Sorry, John. John, love you the most, but enough. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> we need a break from you, sir, okay? Same as you, William. You yeah. need a break from all you men trash. The only men I stand mm-hmm. are Brady and uh, uh, John. Exactly. The only men I stand. Exactly. Ooh, literally. Yes. <laughs> only men I stand. Um, and Kenny. Oh, and speaking Kenny, obviously. Kenny. Kenny. Speaking of oh, Kenny... Yeah. How cute yeah. was he? I know. Like, I know. I... Them in the barn. Let's just talk about that. Let's just talk about the barn, right? Yeah. When they're like, oh, it's not too bad over here. Pans over. Literally, don't touch me. Like, don't. Just don't. Like, why did we yeah. do that? Like, why did we? Mm, please. And then Kenny with the, Kenny with the, or no, the fist bump and and Brainy's like, I'm like, Brainy is the sweetest. He, like, I it's his pure innocence him. for me. I and mean, he's just mm-hmm. like, he's just so oblivious. And I love that. I love that for him. Like, I literally love it for he's him. So too. cute. He's just Ugh. like the most precious. I'm just like, every, yeah. Oh, yeah. And he, like, is so genuine about it. He's I just, know. Like, like honestly, funny. nobody could play Brainy the way Jesse plays him. I'm sorry. Like, I could not uh, yeah. anybody else play Brainy the way Jesse does. And that's fine. I completely agree. He's like, so talented. Literally, literally. Oh my gosh. He's Even, a- do you remember in season four when him and Nia were like kidnapped by those whatever evil people and he, he like got, before he got rebooted and he had like that whole breakdown where he went into like four different like iterations of Brainiac and yeah, he was yeah, just yeah. sitting there and oh my it was oh it was so good i just feel like yeah i just feel like nobody understands the character more than jesse and like he just nailed it every single time like oh and like not even just as like like he understands like every brainiac it seems because every time Mm. he plays different versions of brainy it's just like i'm completely sold on him like honestly oh my gosh he's really incredible to be honest Honestly, somebody better cast him in something soon because that man's talent cannot go to waste. Yeah. You, y'all are missing out if y'all no one cast this man again on then like he is like everything. I'm about to pull what I do with my women where I like look through their whole filmography and I'm like oh, Honestly what though. Are you doing? Like, like I'm about, I'm about to, to Jesse Ratt stuff. Yeah. Literally I'm about to become like a full on Jesse Ratt stand again at this point. Yeah. Like, I swear to God, this man is starting I'm, I'm happening i'm starting to get owned i know i accept 
I'll do the cooking, I'll do the cleaning, Jesse. It's fine. Yeah. I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh you're right though like oh that's king that's a king so Lumpy, like honestly we appreciate him we appreciate him um okay wait so we had yes the barn and then i think we went back to the ship and everything was like sort of okay yeah we had the dance and then it was like uh, man i don't know listen this is all a whirlwind i don't know what the heck happened i know there's so, there's so much that happened i'm just like it's hard to like kind of you know, work out what happened next, but um, crack it, yeah. What happened? Um, <laughs> so hold on, should I look? Hold on, I still have the ep- let's oh, no. let's let's do a little because I know that there was like the cat grin and the stuff that we have to talk about as well. Um, yes, okay, so what, yeah, we'll talk, we'll talk about that. <gasps> oh, oh well. my gosh, can we talk about when those blue people or whatever were trying to capture them and Kara was like in the bushes and like her little yes she out. was like oh, scary yeah. in there with the video i'm like hello ma'am like okay like Damn. Was, i'm i will that was scary you. literally i was like oh, that's like oh holy crap i was like i'm a lo- lowkey terrified <laughs> i'm like okay yeah <laughs> oh my gosh okay so then we had nia seeing the empty cage and it was like oh gosh what does that mean we already captured them haha <laughs> and immediately i was like oh it's cat then it's gotta be cat it's gotta yeah. be cat cat grant but- let's the way that she like like she like normal people would be afraid of the aliens right like normal people would be like afraid but she yeah. found the spaceship and she's like it's fine like hey like she what <laughs> she like, she gets captured and she yeah. does not even she's like can I have my phone back like I need that I'm just like yeah Girl, she has no chill and I love that for her like it is so cat like yeah nothing scares this woman yeah she's corny that's why like she just doesn't care i missed she literally kept throwing a rock i yeah oh my god when we heard that speech again for the first time i was like wow like oh that brought that took me back like i I like the bride you know what i need a cat grant to be like my siri or like something like my gps on oh the my thing. god like i need yeah. her voice to like motive yeah. i feel like she can motivate me to do anything i'm not here for it like yeah that's so true oh my gosh like she would just give you like an immediate pep talk honestly what, what, just, oh. what the heck kenny said something oh he's a squeaky toy and he was like or she was like you kenneth are not a squeaky toy and I'm like, she's oh like yeah Ken, she's like oh, he's yeah. like kendall kendall what is it <laughs> oh kendall yeah kendall, oh my gosh Please. it's her yeah. one-liners it's oh. her one-liners me even when she was getting arrested i know oh. And she's like, this yeah. jacket's worth more than your yearly salary. I'm like, I'm dead. Yeah. Cat grand fucking oh my icon. God. Literal legend. She is some, like, she really is something. Like, I don't even, oh. like she's just something special. I don't even know. Okay, like, so then we had Alex bringing Cara to prom. Oh, wait, go ahead. Wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. I wasn't going to say anything. I was going to say something, but like, not yet. Later on. It's not yet. Okay um so then we had oh my gosh i love this line where um cara was like i just don't know if i made the right choice and then alex was like you did because you made it and i was just like just rip my heart at this point (laughs) just rip my Uh, heart and also while we're talking about that kyla directed the episode yeah oh queen. before we f- before i forget oh, to mention it later because like i'll forget later but like queen yeah. directed the yeah. hell out of this episode like of course she did of course honestly she did. Like, like, I, like, queen. like i was surprised yeah. no we're not like she did no. that and that's probably why i love this episode oh so much. yeah She's, she they're so talented twice because she's so talented i can't how the hell i know i just do every- oh. and then melissa released a book she's like worked on a book yeah, I'm book. I'm like, like yeah. Queen. I'm like, what is happening? Like, this, her, Wait, she uh, just dropped that. It wasn't even like I'm. I'm like in the middle of writing a book. She was like, I wrote it. Here's the pre order. I was <laughs> like, okay, Queen, serve me. Honestly, I'm here for it. Yeah, catch so me good. reading it though. Don't even like read books, but like catch me reading. Honestly, it. anything to support okay. her, legit. Like, anyway, side yeah. side note. Oh my gosh, on. the episode, just the chapter discussions. <laughs> oh my god, dead Katie. <laughs> actually oh my gosh please oh my god 
reveal we oh so then we had the reveal we had the reveal of nia's dress please nobody talk to me ever again like when he said when he said stunning you look stunning she looked absolutely phenomenal like gorgeous she looked like everything she looked fine there was like nothing she looked at i'm speaking like speechless i've been calm like yeah no you're right you're right and then they had their little dance and it was so cute yeah the dance oh, was the cutest that. thing the, yeah i like said before oh, yeah, they so had on the cat- shoulder was just yes oh love them mm. these two these two said end game material honestly exactly honestly. exactly so then we had cat doing the little throwing the rocks at the spaceship <laughs> coin only she's like mm. yes. oh my god <laughs> Just so ridiculous. I just love that she was captured. All? Yeah, I love, and like yeah. even when Kara came on the ship and like just punched the aliens, I was like, oh, yeah, I'm like, man, oh. punch me. I'm next. I'm getting in line to punch me next. Yeah. Line. Oh my god. Oh, she looks so, so cute in her dress too. I was like, yeah. Oh, looks so cute. Look so Kenny cute. in his little suit. Like, oh my gosh. The way oh. he sacrificed himself for Kara, though, like he like gave himself up. I was oh like, my gosh. boy, I respect you. And then, you know what's funny? Know. It, was like, there were, it was paralleling. It was parallel, paralleling, parallels to, mm. and I'm reaching, it was parallels to when Lena was sacrificing her stuff for Kara. So, like, I'm just saying, they want to make it a romantic right. thing. When I don't think it's a reach. It. It's I, not a reach, it's facts. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but, like, you know, <laughs> he sacrificed yeah. himself. And it's obviously, it's, it's in a romantic, ge- it's a romantic gesture. Like, it's obviously, you know. But when Lena does it, it's true. not. Make That's it true. make sense. That's all I'm saying. And Kara was willing to, friend. yeah, she was willing to risk her identity <laughs> for Kenny as well. She was willing to risk it, and she risked her identity for Lena in the 100th ep- in that alternate. So, like, bitch, I can make mm-hmm. a whole book mm-hmm. of <laughs> the parallel. I'm telling you, like, if you're right, someone's like, if they do, like, if they're doing like the Kenny and Kara parallels. So, because like you know, Kenny was Kara's Lana, because like uh, Clark and Lana, Clark and Lois, mm-hmm. like that was her mm-hmm. Lana, and then Lena's her Lois. I'm like, don't touch me. Mm. Like, do I think they're gonna do it? No, because I'm not. I'm a clown. Like, I'm I, I'm gonna be realistic. They're not gonna. They're weak. They're not gonna do it. But you know, what yeah. Like if like, hey, don't be shy. Surprise us. Like, it just <laughs> bugs me. We have to do a super cool brand at one at some point. Um, in the hiatus. Yeah. Like, the writers, yeah. like, do the writers realize they're writing the greatest love story on television? Like, do they realize? Like, oh my god! The more they really? try and deny it, the more it's so obvious. Like, the, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's literally, so- okay. Literally, I was talking to our friend Nathan, right, and I was showing him like this one clip of from the episode we're gonna watch, where um, I think it's episode two of season four where Kara was like, they were all in the basement or whatever, and Lena's like, Kara, stay here. Like, I'm going to protect you. We're all going to be fine. And Kara, like, is trying to, like, be Supergirl without being Supergirl. And I'm like, oh, my gosh, this is so good. And immediately, like, a minute in, he was like, wait, so is that Lena? I was like, yeah. He was like, yeah, they're they're wives. I'm like, yeah, exactly. <laughs> like, really exactly. Like, like, even people who like, don't even watch the show, can see yeah like yeah. I swear he's like so this is super corp huh i was like mm-hmm. he was like they're they're married I'm like, yeah <laughs> exactly exactly four seasons five seasons five seasons yeah of pain oh my God. and angst yeah. for no reason at all yeah like for nothing probably for nothing probably. it makes me angry because yeah. i'm just like i swear if they really try and force William on me, I swear to God, I'm gonna vomit. Oh. On the I'm gonna just vomit on the camera. No, like, I will. You'll literally see me throw up in person, like live. Like I swear to God, <laughs> I'm just like you. If you really want to give Kara that great love story, Lena's right there. And like the thing that annoys me, as I keep saying it, I keep saying it, I'm gonna keep saying it. If Lena was a male character, was a man, they would have been together. They would be married season by season four, four legit. That's yeah, that, that, yeah. that would have been engaged, and married. They would have had a kid by now. That's what I'm saying. You are right. You are completely right. Like, so oh it's like, oh, yeah. why don't the writers want to utilize something that's going to be groundbreaking? Like, why wouldn't you want to utilize? Like, 
it doesn't make sense to me. Not not because I'm a super cool sh- shipper or whatever, but like in the terms of like you know getting your audience excited, making waves on social media. Like, why wouldn't you want to do that and make your show yeah. revolutionary, like groundbreaker? Why wouldn't you capitalize capitalize off them? Like, I don't understand. Like, why wouldn't you? I don't know. It just doesn't make any it, but sense. Then it, but then it could be, it could be the whole like, oh, the writers want to, but hmm, not allowed, which is, listen, Homophobic. I've heard crazier, <laughs> I've heard crazier theories, but yeah, oh yeah, Homophobic. <laughs> like I've heard crazier theories. So literally, you know, literally though. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah we're surprised. gonna have to do a full blown like super corporate or something. <laughs> um, probably a straight man. Yeah. I'm not topping. Like no, can't have that. Yeah, you back my word. Mm-hmm. I'm just like, mm, okay. I can't have a gay super girl. That'd First be of all, crazy I don't... for some reason. Please, Car is an alien. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> like the yeah. most. She loves who she loves. Leave it alone. Like, yeah. Like literally, I think it's either like she's like pansexual or like nothing or like I'm gonna go on my little my little ship and I'm gonna say asexual Kara would be a dream but yeah because yeah. i would full be down yeah. for that i think that's really good representation i'll be full down for that if they do if they went that way yeah so but I, again i don't think they will because tv especially doesn't like to do that because they're like no everybody's got to be available to be in a couple like mm. everybody's got to be usable dating material and like if we had the lead character not available for romance then what's the point is like what people think which is just yeah. ridiculous but here we are <laughs> here so, we are with our clown masks on as usual yeah. um <laughs> anyway anyways yeah. um anyway so what, then we ha- had Kara um falling to her doom <laughs> mm-hmm. yes <laughs> um yeah. from the kryptonite <laughs> Um, I I thought this was gonna be like way worse for her though, to be honest. Like well, it was she was her, just like yeah, it was yeah. her first time like, getting exposed to kryptonite. So like, she's like, what's going on? Yeah. Like, it was like scary, you know. And like yeah, and you know what's funny? People were like, you know how the moon like she got healed because like the, she had the moonlight on her. People were like also oh, yeah, moon, also like give her a pass. I'm like, hello, the sun. Shot the sun's rays. Yeah, so see, I was gonna bring that up. Yeah, I was gonna bring that up because apparently I have no brain cells, and I thought the same thing. Where I was just, I like, love that so, for you. <laughs> I was just like, so the moon can do it too. But like, okay, I would have understood. I understand it now, obviously. But like, I guess I didn't learn that in my science class, or I don't remember. Yeah. But um, I because remember when Kara like was um like beat up by red daughter and mm. alex was like Gra- take the grass whatever it's like so why didn't the moon work then was it too cloudy <laughs> like, yeah yeah was yeah, it yeah. not powerful enough like there's questions but there's questions yeah i was one of those was cloudy that was like yeah. oh it was hiding behind the clouds so the moon too? Yeah. yeah yeah i yeah, think you said in your reaction one, yeah one. i think you said in your reaction yeah, yeah. and i was like oh God, yeah man, bless your soul <laughs> No, I didn't, I, I didn't did, know. I did think the same. I did, in my reaction, I'm like, oh, wait, the moon doesn't, I'm like, oh, wait, hold on. The sun, it's the, ref- yeah. I was, but yeah, I, I, I did didn't... think of it too. I was like, hold on, wait. I'm like, oh, wait, no, it's the sun, like the thing, yeah. I didn't, I don't listen. It's okay. We all have our moments. I never cool. said I was smart. Okay. <laughs> Dead. <laughs> okay. Listen, uh, anyway, I might have forgotten or I might not have ever learned that in my life. So I must have. I just, it's okay. We love anyway, educating on. in a super cool episode. Yeah. Like if you learn something that day. Yeah. You learn that yeah. Brain yeah. See, you learn things. You we learn, learn things. things. Exactly. Exactly. It's yeah, experience. It's fine. Um, yes. So then Kenny sacrificed himself mm-hmm. like the king that he is. Honestly, though. Oh, Kenny. As soon as he was like... I'm the Kryptonian. I was just like, Kenny, no. <laughs> like, if he dies, yeah. I really thought he was going to die when they fixed time and, like, the meteor was, like, coming, crashing through the window. Oh, my yeah. God. Yeah, me too. And he's like, that See, was close. I'm like, boy, don't even tease me. I thought I was being dumb again. But so I cut it out of my reaction where I was like, oh my gosh, they're, are they going to, no, like, don't, don't get rid of Kenny. Oh my gosh. I thought I was being dumb again, but then I watched everybody else's reactions and they're like, oh my gosh, Kenny, wow. 
much out. I was like, dang, okay, so I wasn't mm. dumb that time. But... I feel like, yeah, I feel like the writers <laughs> were like kind of teasing because they're like, oh, because he because he died the first time in the other mid episode. So they're like, yeah, Let's yeah, tease I... again, twice, but then he's gonna survive. <laughs> I was like, like... aha, psych. <laughs> So Just funny. Like, yeah. Don't <laughs> Do not harm my child, please. I will fight all of you. Yeah. <laughs> so technically, he's out there. Exactly. Just, and I have to say, the awesome. way that they broke up was so respectable. It was like the most mature thing. Because, like, I yeah. love how Kara was like, you know, I have to go to National City, you know, for me. Like, I have to do this for myself. Mm-hmm. And he's like, I just, I just love how they both had their own kind of realization that he's. I, it was just so sweet. I was just like, yeah. "This is nice." Like, yeah, they were like, you know, sweet. And then they walked off into the sunset. Like, yeah, they had a little movie, and I'm like, you know what? I do kind of see them more as like friends, like kind of best friends, I guess. Like mm-hmm. later on, like not now, you know, they had the little thing, mm-hmm. but like it was, it was cute. It was, yeah. I, I don't know. I just really, he really respected Kara. He's like the only man that's actually respected Kara all the time yeah like he really like respected yep, her feelings right. was you like i understand you know, he just treated her with respect yeah. i was like I, I understand your decision this is how i'm feeling and it was just it was beautiful i'm like you know yeah. what god bless it was I a good it. little arc for them yeah, i think it was, it was too it was a nice and someone's mm-hmm. like i saw him going on twitter saying young kara is the only crowd that has yeah. chemistry with the men i'm like i'm dead <laughs> i'm like don't <laughs> And I'm like, I didn't oh. say <laughs> but um <laughs> yeah. yeah but no um no it was a really sweet, it was a really so, scene love that for yeah people. love that for them they said yeah, yeah it was really like mature of them which was great I love that for them I know it was, um, it was good it was good so, Go yeah Wait so then we got them shoving them away they they moved into like that little broom closet looking whatever room and please, please, with Nia being stressed out and Brainy going, okay, let's just nine to five, shall we? <laughs> you're, you're, if you're like, oh my God. <laughs> Not even like trying to sing nine to five, bless his soul. That's their song he's now. He's trying song. so hard. Like he's really trying so hard. It's because like, that's what comforts him now. Like that's their song. Like now he, you know, yeah, can, that's their song. That's it. They, that, that's that's it. So cute. Like he did it twice. He did it oh. twice. Even in yeah. the forest, in the, in the forest or whatever, with the, you know, wherever he was. Yeah. Was like, oh. My, oh my he just walked heart. away singing under his breath. I was like, oh my God, that's so fucking cute. Please, I'm deceased. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I love anything, him so much. I love anything him. Jesse does. Turns to gold. We're eating it up. We are literally eating it up. Everything he touches turns to gold. I'm just like any one yeah. line he says is just. It, it, it's like yep, yeah, I love that. You're right. I, uh, You're absolutely right. Gosh. Beautiful. Okay. So then, then we had little baby Cara being like, "No, I'm going with you," and then Nia being like, "No." <laughs> She's like <laughs> silence. <laughs> silence. Yeah. yeah. Please. Oh please. my gosh. Literally. Oh my gosh. She's so I, powerful. That was new, yeah. Like, uh, yeah. okay, girl, but it makes sense. I mean, dream or <laughs> that, yeah, that's true. That's true. Yeah, that's true. No, that's that's true. You're right. You're right. But yeah. Um. Then we had Cat being stuck in here, giving Kenny the little pep talk. Absolutely, yup, iconic. Mm-hmm. You are not a squeaky toy. So good. Um. Then I'm- Alex and Kara were having their little talk. About, yeah, like, I really love Kara and Alex. Yeah, basically. I love their talk. Mm-hmm. It was such a Alex and They're Kara so thing. I was like, yes, these two. They embody. We two. said it last week, and we'll say it again. They embodied. They embody Melissa and Kyla. Like they just embody the way. Yeah. It just if I told you, Supergirl just cast the correct actors and actresses for the younger mm-hmm. roles. Because I feel like these actresses, they studied the characters and they studied their mannerisms. They studied yeah. the things that they say, and like it's just. It's just beautiful. Like I was watching that episode, and like I didn't even think that the main cast majority like weren't even in it, because like I was like, "That's yeah. Melissa and Katie." Like as kids, like that's them. Like they were here. Yeah. Like, I, I felt that, and I was like, I didn't. I wasn't really missing. Oh yeah, I didn't miss a little bit, but like, 
I was too like drawn into their story and like you know their performances yeah like, it's like oh I miss them but like you don't miss the characters because they're here <laughs> like and it's just yeah like, literally oh my gosh they're so like you really buy it like they really just are I think even Kyler said something like when her and Melissa saw them like acting against each other Kyler was like it was really freaky it looked like they, we were like looking in a mirror <laughs> and I was yeah, yeah, just yeah. like you're right because that's how it feels Oh, you know what? Like, imagine those two watching. Like, that is that is so like mind boggling. Like, to sit mm. there and watch these two people playing younger you, and they're like absolutely nailing it. Yeah. And you're just and sitting there. As like... Carla's directing it too, like it's just like yeah, she, like it's oh, how it would be such an out of body experience. But she's like, that's me. Like, that's Alex. Like, that's crazy. Yeah, these actresses did fantastic. Oh, like, ten out of ten. Yeah, they deserve the entire world for everything. For real, even they are one, so even, good. yeah, even the girl that played Cat, young Cat as well. Like as I said, like yeah, embodied, embodied oh Callista. Like that was her. Mm-hmm. Like yeah. even, even like the whole when she got arrested, when Kara like reversed something, she's like, I want to remember that name, Kira. I'm like dead. I'm like I yeah, missed, I missed her. So- I don't know. I just really, I, I honestly last week I had forgotten that Cat used to call her Kira because I just forgot, you know, because I hadn't watched the early season mm-hmm. eight so when she said i was like uh, wow the way i missed her saying kira oh mm-hmm. is just it was yeah just, i love it i love it so oh much. that she that is, relationship is so like i, I really miss Kara and cat man i just miss their relationship yeah oh the I reveal mm. the reveal when or Kara like walks off or whatever and cat's sitting there and she's like go get him super girl don't I oh, know don't even touch, me. touch don't. me like oh it's that's so perfect she, it's it's, so it's oh, good because she knows oh my god that's why I respect Kat because even like she knew the, pretty much this whole time or like maybe what I don't know from hell but she just knew that it was her yeah. like she because she's not and that's the same thing even remember when James was guarding and she's like I could see your eyes through the slit in the in the helmet yeah. Like, I know it's you, James. I'm like, what a queen! Like, please. I oh my god. Legit. She, like, she just she just she cannot fool anybody. Like, no one can fool Catherine. That's why I love her. Yeah. She's like, I see you. Like, you're, like oh, she cool. kept it real. You know, she kept the mm-hmm. shit real. I'm like, I love that for her. Like, I that's why that. I said. Oh my like, gosh. Even what was it? Was it when the flash came over? And she said, "You look like the ah, uh, like oh." Wow. She said, "Um." You look. Oh, I know the line because I fucking love it. Um, she said, "You look like the racially diverse cast of a CW," and I'm like, "Oh, what the fuck?" <laughs> it's the most saving thing oh in God. the whole world. <laughs> so good. Oh, so I really. Good. Oh my I wish she never left. The amount of one would have got it. Can I just say, if Cat Grant oh was is still on the show, she would have made Supercorp canon in season three. I'm gonna tell you this right now. Oh yeah, she, she would have been have... like, Kara, are you dumb? She's like, or no, excuse me, in... she would have said, Kira, are you dumb? She's right there. <laughs> Kira, what are you doing? This lesbian is in love with you. Like, are you kidding? Like, are you blind? Yeah. No, she, yeah. Like, literally. Like, come like, on. Oh my gosh. She would have pushed them to each other already. She'd been like, you guys, like, just like, get it over with. <laughs> like, oh well, She God. would have, whatever. So cute. It's, oh, everything. I said, I, oh, I, I, I made it. Come back. I, I uh, made it. I made a tweet and I was like, can you imagine like if Cat Grant comes back potentially, like yeah, hypothetically, you know, and she comes strutting through her private mm-hmm. elevator and like Nia's nee there, Nia's nee there to greet her <sighs> and she's walking in, you know, with her coffee in her bag. Well, you know how she goes and she's like, has Kat, she says to me, have Kira and the lesbian doing here like acknowledge your feelings yet? I'm tired. I'm going to expire. Like, I just like, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> like please yeah. I want to yeah. die you know <laughs> no that's iconic but know. speaking of Nia um, and Kat that scene yeah mm-hmm. N- who knew Nia is the reason so now that Nia iconic. invented Kat Cole. literally she invented Kat Grant 100% <laughs> like oh my gosh like the girl founded Kat Co. Like no, literally, she did. Like it's fact at this point. Like she did. Like, wow. Like oh she really gosh. just. Yeah. She did that. I I, I loved it. I just. And do you yeah. think? 
because I can't remember how did who ended up hiring Nia at Catco? Was it Cat? I know she was in the show at the time, but was who hired Nia? Because maybe Cat like had a suspicion. I was like, oh, she looks familiar. She like knew I that she had to hire. Thought her. it was. Was it James? I thought it was James. <laughs> the but way I, I forgot James was in charge at some point. Kat. Yeah, I know. The way I forgot James was in charge of Catco at some point. I know, like, I think, um, but before she got hired, I know she worked with Kat. She was, like, her press mm. secretary or something. So, like, like do you think DC. she hired Nia because, oh, yeah, she was talented, but, like, she also had, like, a gut feeling that, like, I need to hire this girl, like, something about mm. her because of what happened in the past. Because, obviously, her memory got erased. It was in a different timeline, whatever. But, like, yeah. or, you know, but, like, when well, no, it wasn't erased, it, it, it would have happened. Maybe she's, like, she looks familiar. Like, yeah, okay, about yeah. her. But like yeah. I need to, you know. I it would know. be fun. <laughs> but she invented that. That was just, I love. I oh really, my gosh, I, that was incredible. I loved it. Like I really loved. And that. not really Nia giving that. Cat a cat speech. Like yeah, literally I just, though. I love that. That's what she She's deserves. She's the icon. You know? I loved. Yeah. I love this episode, man. Nia, guys, just Nia. Also, okay, we're at the scene, right? I'm skimming the episode. This entire episode, by the way. Um. <laughs> We're at the scene where Brainy is like, oh, we have a 20% success rate. And he's <laughs> like, that's an 80% chance of failure. And he's like, yes, it's terrible. Like, <laughs> and then he starts saying, please. <laughs> They're so oh good, my God. man. They're so... Their chemistry is just mm. perfect. It's Literally. Perfect. It's that just, like, it that couldn't really... get better. They really did that. That's what I'd love to see. Every ship having their own moment. These two episodes were about Brainia. Now I want an entire dancing mm-hmm. thing. And I think it's going to be mm-hmm. episode 12. I'm going to pray episode 12 is going to be like dancing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Allie, you know. And then like, we need a super cop. Like, not going to lie. But um, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. it's just like, I swear to God, I just thought of this. this is gonna, I'm going to get cancelled. But imagine, and if I'm not going to manifest this, because if by this man it gets manifested, I'm going to jump out the window. I'm not even kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Like, and I even okay. hate myself for thinking this, but like, it's something that the Supergirl writers would do to say screw you to the Supergirl fans. I uh, do. Can you imagine if, like, in that scene, it's like Supergirl William and Kara. If um, Lena's mm-hmm. like, oh, sorry, Supergirl Kara, Supergirl Lena and William. Sorry. Mm-hmm. If Lena's yeah, yeah, like, yeah. I was wrong. Yeah. If imagine if Lena's like, oh, you should ask William out, or you should like give him another chance. If she says that to her, the way I will block every fucking rider on that damn show. <laughs> I swear, so oh bitch. I, I know why. I I'm not. not I, really I, I can't believe I even said that, but like it popped in my head, like because like I wouldn't be surprised if the super riders even like did that to just like say screw you. Like, yeah. I wouldn't put it past if Lena was like the catalyst. For William McCarr, I would be like, you are trash, all of you to me. Don't speak to me. Dead to me. All of you dead to me. Uh, <laughs> but anyways. I'm thinking about him doing it now, and I'm just like, like the biggest eye roll of just like. That party. would be the worst thing to ever happen. I feel like I will literally stop reacting. No, I wouldn't do that. I love the cast too much. I would not do that. <laughs> I love the cast too I was much. Like, oh! Wow. I just, oh it would God. be the biggest f you to the super cool fans and i'd be like yeah. wow it's literally like clark killing bellamy for me like it would literally be like that no spo- uh, spoilers if you haven't watched 100 was... spoiler alert <laughs> <laughs> spoiler alert like yeah, sorry but like mm. if something like that ha- mm. what was the mm. anyway we anyways. already talked about it go watch our 100 podcast yes. if you're anyways to one. but like anyway what the heck Anyway, anyway, yeah. Um, yeah. Also, I'm yeah. just going to be like, listen, I don't do this normally because, again, like, I don't know. I talk about, oh, stunning women. Yes. Mwah, like, beautiful. But, like, normally I am not, like, this thirsty over somebody. Yeah. But, like. Oh, girl, welcome to my life. Who are you, who are you listen, over? I'm just going to say the way that when Nia was, like, going into her second dream and she was, like falling asleep or whatever and she's like brainy <laughs> not Adam, being a like... simp on camera dead <laughs> who would have thought <laughs> it's okay you should be i know you should be embrace I... it embrace it let it out you have to it was so you. hot 
<laughs> Embrace, let's go, go. I'm <gasps> you. That's it. Me with Listen, Lena. Um, anytime you... Lena breathes. Anytime Lena breathes. Literally, mm -hmm. I'm like, I will duck you. First, Maybe. it was Nicole. Ooh, I let her off with a big warning for that dress. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But then she got some nerve going in there going, Brady, don't even. Like the way you haven't <laughs> risked it all, like, like you should just, like, just risk it all. Like, you, it's, it's like that dress. Like, I'm surprised you weren't like, yep, I'm marrying you. Like, oh, here's my, like, take my hand in marriage. Like, let's go. Like, Oh, I've been, yeah, I've been there mentally, but I guess I had to say it out loud. Yes, I, yeah. I will risk it all for Brainia. Risk it all. Thank you. <laughs> Literally all. made the super cool. I That's felt it. that in my like, soul. At least yours should happen. So, so look, at least yours, yours is actually canon. So like, live it up. <laughs> I'm jealous of you. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, but you're on the ship too, okay? So, like, listen, we're. Oh, yeah, driving? I'm on the ship too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love Brandy. I'm on the ship too. Don't worry. I love it. I would yeah. die for those two. It's fine. I'm Hold also on. winning. Hold on. That's okay. Excuse me. Da, 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 <laughs> the Brandy flag. I'm sorry. Your reaction kills me every time you just got that fucking flag. I'm like, yep, yeah, you wave that. You wave it. Like, it's what. It's what I don't know do. what to do anymore. Like, it's just here. SS Brainy. That's what it says. Oh I love gosh. that. I literally love that. Now we need to talk about the kiss because, like, we haven't spoken about the kiss yet. I don't know that destroyed. <laughs> <laughs> we saved the best part for last. Let's be honest. <laughs> <laughs> so the kiss, right? I'm feeling. I feel like insert clip of Katie watching the kiss for the first time, like. <laughs> <laughs> what the oh they got some nerve they really got some nerve Let with that just, oh. i want to try and play it like on my phone because like oh my gosh I what? Like, because it's so funny and i'm like <laughs> i don't know what to do with myself anymore i literally love for you while we're here, oh my gosh, everybody go watch our reactions, please. We make reaction videos if you didn't already. If you're not here from watching the reaction videos somehow, um, go watch them. We do reaction videos. But, oh my gosh, they really just... <sighs> okay. Do it all it. for me. Okay, I got No, it. I heard that. It's Shut the scream up. for me. <laughs> okay. Hold on. Okay, right, right, yeah. <laughs> and then he just kept going, and I was like, am I just supposed to sit here? <laughs> Okay. <laughs> it's you did a you did an abnormally Adam scream. Like I love that for you. I did. I did. Uh, the past two episodes, I really have just been here. I've been in that zone. I guess. Um, at least you're in normally, it. I'm like, I get excited about things, but normally I'm like pretty like chill. I think I would say, be like, oh, that's really cool. Whoa. But like that all went out the window. I guess. Mm -hmm. Like after this episode, it's anything goes at this point like, it's <laughs> it's because when it's your favorite ship and they actually are getting screen time and developing and it's just like everything you want like it's just yep. it's satisfying how do you not scream over it? like i feel like yep. it's been long overdue for a brainy scream let's be honest like they haven't had a, right. a lot of scenes in a long time it's about it's, time it's yeah. about damn time okay I, see i didn't even know i think everybody kind of had this problem too um where we were like so are they together again are we like trying to mm. fix the relationship are they like dating but they haven't done anything romantic yet i guess it was the latter because we just had a kiss and it was like chill yeah. it was like fun. i feel like, from, like yeah from this point i feel like you know they're dating like it was like slow yeah it's like in the, it was the first episode when they made the pinky promise right and i was mm -hmm. like stop yeah it. Um, 
dead. I thought like, that was it. I thought like, yeah. please. I thought that was the peak. Huh. Yeah, but like we know they're gonna like it's oh, please. It doesn't even. It just even if they weren't dead, and like it, it just felt right for him to kiss her because like after all they went through in those two episodes, like how do you not like, like mm-hmm. you know, it was just it was really yeah. it was really sad. And the way he was like to her, what do you say? He's like, you're the one who saved who's saved Carl. Like you know when she comes back, you're the you're you're the reason for it. I'm like as you yeah, should. like praise. You're her. right. Like we. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Like it's just the oh, way he's respectful for me. It's the way he's respectful for me. I'm yes. Just like, get you yes. a man like Brainy. Thank you. Oh my gosh, that man. That's a that is the only man. The only man. Literally, really, that. genuinely. Everyone else, I don't know. Oh my anyone. god. I don't know Brainy. No. No. Also, let's go back to when. So Brainy and Nia get on ship, right? Mm. And she sees cat and she's like that's cat grant ma'am ma'am i thought we've been here like she really was like brainy that's cat i was just like okay (laughs) (laughs) like yeah (laughs) what like oh my gosh okay anyway then carter came in bam bam oh my gosh iconic iconic she said you want a kryptonian you got one honestly she this was a great mm. episode. I really, I'm going to miss the Midvale episode. I'm not going to lie. I'm going to miss know. them a lot because they're just so sweet, so pure, so innocent. Yeah, really, really so talented cool. too. Yeah. Like, oh my gosh. Even the cast behind the scenes is just like so cute. Like, mm. oh, I just so love them. Also, oh no. So we're up to the part where Kara got arrested and Kenny got arrested and Alex comes running through. Oh my God. Alex oh, running God. through. Oh, don't touch me. Get away from my sister. Don't. Gosh, awful. And then Kara stowed away on the ship. I love, I love that she did it though. Like, I actually, how good was she just like, broke out of the handcuffs and, and flip on my girl? Yeah. I'm stressed. Yep. yep. <laughs> and the three of them being like, Nia being like, well, she has a point. And Brittany being like, no, 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 hold on. I was like, oh my gosh. Like, mm. let's discuss yeah. this, whatever. Then Alex and Kenny came. <laughs> and the Brainy's Alex is like, and what are you wearing? And Brainy's like, what am I wearing? What are you? <laughs> but like, so- she, he got scared of her. He was like, I'll take anything. I can never lie to you. I'm like, bless yourself. Yeah. He's like, I'll take anything you want to know. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh, I, I love it. So what else are we supposed to say about the man, really? Like, oh, honestly, so it's. Good. Like, I love he you. just he's it. He is it. Like, oh man. So then they like fix it. Everyone goes back in time, whatever the heck they fix it. Blah blah blah. Car says thank you, and then we say goodbye to the Midvale kids. <sighs> We're fine. We go back to save Kara. Yeah. That's it. Also, cat like makes cat co makes a little. Oh, he's like, and thing. it's cat grand. I'm like, God bless. Yeah. <gasps> Oh, the like, way hello. they got that that close up, it's cat yeah. to grim. I'm, I'm like, like oh. as you should, as you should. Mm-hmm. And that was the mm-hmm. first. Oh. And I really appreciate, even though we, we feel like I don't, I really doubt we're gonna get Kalista back. I highly doubt it. I'm not gonna hold it. Yeah. However, yeah. having like Cat's, I guess, origin story of how she, be, how she became the legend Cat Grant, it was really, it was mm-hmm. nice to see. Because I obviously yeah. lost Kat. So I was like, it was just nice to see how she started her empire, I guess. Well, thanks to Nia mm-hmm. and obviously Kat's talented, like, existence. But, like, you know, yeah. it was nice to see it. And I, and I liked it. Yeah, so yeah it it's a nice, good. almost like, if they can't get Callista back, which, yeah, like, let's not bank on it. But um, if they can't, it's a nice little, like, call back to, like, bring her back in for a bit for a couple episodes. Yeah, like, it's one. nice that we didn't forget the roots of the show because you know cat was like pretty much was like iconic yeah. in season one and season two but like it was nice to just have a little yeah. bit of a you know throwback you know it was nice it was nice so i really appreciated that yeah so. this episode guys woo! I t- oh my gosh when we talk to like whoever it is tomorrow oh my gosh you're kidding me no it's fine i'm fine i'm not fine but i'm fine <laughs> 
This video won't process. <laughs> Why won't it process? I'm so ass. Well, but is it not? Is it ninety five percent process? Or like maximum upload? No, it just said processing abandoned video is too long. What hell does it go for again? I'm fine. It's like two and a half hours. <laughs> like no, a little bit under two and a half hours. But haha. -ha. Anyway, anyway, back to Supergirl. Hi, yeah. Maybe you can mm. edit that. That's okay. I love editing. Yeah. Uh, the mid seat, just my mm, panic. Yes. Um. Yes. Good. I get like, man, this season. That's it. Like, this is really it for me. Like, if it just keeps up this pace, even even if it doesn't, I think easily this is my favorite half of a season that we, I've gotten. That's from true. Show. Actually, I have to agree with that. I would like, like to, I would like to hope that it continues the trend the trend continues. I would like to hope it again. We've been burned one too many about actually like nine too many times. Honestly, and... we've been down this road before. Hello, darkness, yeah. my old friend. I'm stressed. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> thanks, CW. Anyway. Um, it's fine. It's but... fine. I'm gonna manifest positive. We're gonna I feel I know. I'm gonna yeah. I know. We'll see what happens. Yeah. I'm gonna take it each week as it comes, that's it because uh, yeah if i think about it too long i'll cry so <laughs> yeah. period you're right okay wait let me i'm gonna go see if we could read some comments oh yes let's read some comments from the last episode uh, okay hold on <laughs> got it ah oh, okay oh my gosh what is the password for this thing okay da -da -da. okay dom peralta came up on me for not seeing Winona Earp. Oh yes, Oops. I read that comment. I did read that comment. Sorry. <laughs> oh, gosh, I know it's kind of surprising to be honest, because a lot of my like mutuals on Twitter watch that show, so I don't know. Just sure. have it on her own TV. Sure. I might. I might during the hiatus. Um. That's true. That's uh, oh my true. gosh. Brandon and Brenda, excuse me. Yeah, that is just. Really <laughs> um okay wait okay somebody she is alive uh says just a random thought what if kenny becomes an astronaut or something because he was always interested in space and he's smart and it would make sense if car breaks up with him to go to national city and he ends up leaving midvale as well i just don't want him to die i support him i support, <laughs> I support that him in this that would actually make a lot of sense kind of because like he's you know Kind of inspired mm -hmm. him to see what's out there. I guess maybe he wanted to explore. Like, I don't know. Interesting. Yeah. I like that theory actually. That'd be cute, honestly. Him and his little astronaut out. Yeah, I support. Yeah, yeah. Sold. Stop. I will die. I'll literally <laughs> die. He's too cute. Yeah. I love him. Oh, shit. Um, I said when you guys kept ranting about the CW and not trusting them, I felt that. <laughs> <laughs> Every episode moving forward will be us not trusting the CW. Mark our words. Absolutely. Yes. <laughs> Even up to the finale, I'm going to be like, no, guys, this is really, mm, we got to be really careful here. No, literally, um, I feel that. I'm like, I will literally not trust these writers until the end no. of the series. If everything goes my our way, no. like that what we want, I could. I won't trust mm. them even until like immediately after the finale. I'll, just, I'll have to like think about it and be like, did they? Yeah. My only as I said last week, and we said last week, our only my our only saving grace is that Melissa is satisfied with the finale. Or yeah. Like, you know, she's satisfied. Yeah. I'm gonna trust this woman. I swear to God, yeah. I'm trusting this woman. <laughs> Melissa, I am trusting you with my entire soul. I only yeah. trust you. I don't trust anybody else. If she's happy, no, I, exactly. Mm. I'm Melissa, mm. I'm begging you, please girl. Please like save us. Melissa, super oh, cool, don't be shy. <laughs> I know she supports it. I know she likes Super Corp, but like, I know Katie's for it. Hey but guys. It's just me being a clown <laughs> again. <laughs> we said, Katie, I love your idea of Nia and Brainy visiting Stargirl and her team. Now I want to see that. Mm, absolutely. Mm -hmm. Yes. Um, Dom said, there's a show on HBO Max called Generation that is really queer and amazing. I don't know if you okay. both heard of it or watched it, but y'all should check it out. There's only eight episodes, about 30 minutes each. They plan on releasing the second part of season one later this year. Oh, okay. Yeah. Interesting. 
Mm. Let me some queer content. I'll check that out. Um, uh, Adam looking handsome in those glasses. Yup. <laughs> <laughs> right. Um. Ba, 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 da, ba, ba, da, ba, ba, car. Uh, car is pair. Okay. Yup. Red Kryptonite episode. You got it. Nia spinoff or legends? Yes. 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 Car is ending. Super corp. Uh, between Katie's interviews and how they've handled Lena this season, I'm clowning, but also this is CW, so still clowning. <laughs> yep, you're I right. I firmly believe they are either leaving Kara single or doing Super Corp. Either is fine with me. There is an interview where Melissa teased the slow burn in season six, but the article was about William and Kara. However, Melissa never mentioned William. That article came That's... out last year, though, so who I knows? remember that article. I remember I was angry because I'm like, um, excuse me, like, no, I'm not at Melissa, like, at the article title that they were, like, implying that William was, like, a slow burn romance. And I'm like, bitch, literally where? Like, show me your <laughs> slow burn. I'm dead. They've literally had three <laughs> episodes together. I will fight every one of you. Yeah. The only slow burn oh, is super cop in this show, I swear to God. Nobody literally. else is a slow burn. That is so true. Like, technically, physically, like, there's no, like, there is no, there cannot be another slow burn. Like, no, but there isn't, season, like, if they can't. I'm just no, no, like who? No, no. <laughs> like oh, I get angry when I think that they classify this as a slow burn. Like I have had no chemistry the yeah. entire show. They've had what three scenes together. They do one karaoke, and everyone's like, "Oh my god, William and Kara slow burn!" Like, um, <laughs> like please, shut wow. up, shut up. Wow. <laughs> Clearly, I have feelings about this still. It's fine. Yeah, yeah, a little pent up, a little pent up aggression. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, it's fine. I feel like every super cool fan has this anger in them. Like, oh yeah. <laughs> I, they said the articles where Melissa teases Kara's ending and her talking about empowerment and the balance between her powers and humanity. I don't know. Screams an alive and single Kara. Kenny being brought back made me go. Hmm. We shall see in the next episode. I'm with mm-hmm. you both. I trust Melissa. If they kill Kara, I won't recover. Mm. Yep. True. True. Uh, in a dream world, I think it would be super cool if they made Kara asexual and pan romantic. Now that's a concept. Yes. 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 And of course, made Super Corp canon and explored the nuances. Hey, just if she's pan romantic, then that still means Super Corp is that could be a thing. That's anyway. True. Um, and explore the nuances of differences between sexual and romantic attraction. But I mean, it's the CW, so they'd never do that. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, though. They only right. know. Oh, no. You're right. Um, uh, they said, do you think... the re- Okay, you already said no, basically. But they said, do you think the real reason Super Corp might not be canon at this point might be because of Melissa? Do you th- I absolutely love and stand her, but do you think she might not want to affect potential future roles? I don't think she's like that, <laughs> personally. Yeah, if so. her, if super, if being, if making super corp canon, and like having representation on the show, you know, ruins future like projects. Then what does that say about the people who are not hiring her? You know, like homophobic. Yeah. Like how do know how that yeah. would like I don't know how that would like. Yeah, I don't know if they're implying Melissa's homophobic, but I just like she's not clearly she's not. We know that, but like, that well, like, maybe she yeah. thinks that like if they think that the people who hire her next might be like, oh, maybe I don't know. Yeah, true. you know how like you know no Hollywood and like you know that kind of thing works, kind of. So like, yeah. I yeah. get it, but if I get it, but I don't feel it. I don't feel that. <laughs> yeah, I don't feel. Yeah, yeah, I feel like, that. Yeah, exactly, yeah. exactly. Look, I just think um, it's a, super cops are wasted potential if they don't you capitalize on it. What the fuck? Are it you is doing? it completely But it's like the way that if they made it canon, the show would be trending every week, like every like every week. Like it would be like on Twitter yeah. moment, it'd be like headlining, like it would be everything. So like No, you're right. You're don't really pull right. don't you dare pull supernatural and make one you know make lena confess her feelings then Kara doesn't reciprocate and then like you know someone has to die like don't do that oh, we do not please. want a supernatural issue okay we do not want that because i will die that I was cannot. a disaster i didn't even watch i cannot go I through that again expected. i cannot physically go through that something like that again i cannot that is I, feel, so, uh, I barely recovered from that after all those seasons huh? <laughs> like you 15 was, uh, okay no, not 15 years 
10 years because he cast came in in season four in season four so like oh. 11 years 11 years oh. oh my gosh yeah that's well, what? <laughs> anyways Yeesh. let me just see i don't know if we got oh my gosh wow we got more um recommendations oh um, yes let me see. Oh my gosh, I don't know which ones we read already, but let's see. We have How Does She Do It, which is the episode where Kara babysits Cat Grant's son. I love that oh, episode. I love that episode. That one is so cute. Um, episode 17, season 4. Kara, Alex, and Lena find out what Eve is up to. Mm. Um, season 5, episode 7. Lena and Kara in the fortress oh, and great dancing content. They want me to really, mm -hmm. like die with that lena scene in the fortress like they want to torture me again because episode yeah. seven ruined my life you want me to ruin my life like they ruined my life okay then we have season so woo, we got a lot okay we got it. season two episode eight 12 and 18 season three episode five and 12 season four episode two 19 and 20 and season five, episode thirteen. Yeah. I'm gonna look. Okay, no, right now. Okay. <laughs> so, uh, so I know uh, they're pretty much basically Lena centric or like super cool centric and like Nia centric. Like if you know what we like, I just feel like yeah. I'm gonna be in my feels and I'm just gonna be like, how I'm gonna I'm gonna get even more. Okay, look, I'll be honest. I haven't rewatched season like older seasons in a long time of super cool. So I feel like yeah. I'm rewatching it. I'm gonna be like, it's gonna make I've me never rewatched the seasons in full. Like I've rewatched like episodes and stuff. Like mm. I've rewatched I might, scenes all the time. Yeah, I feel like I might want to do like a Supergirl rewatch in the hiatus, and then just mm. because, just you know, because yeah. I feel like I, I'm, I yeah. may. But like I know when I watch these episodes, like the ones that they've chosen for us, like I'm gonna get more angry. And <laughs> Supergirl's not canon. I'm gonna get more angry. I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> I'm gonna get so but much it, more angry. It is only natural. Like okay, yeah. you have to do that. So, it's time for Legends, guys, <laughs> basically. Yes, uh, so that was the end of our Supergirl 606 mm -hmm. um, discussion, yeah. rant, whatever you want to call it, the reactive yeah. of tomorrow. Um, now, we're going to be recording our Legends one. So, if you want to see that, click the link in the description box, and we'll leave a link to that one if you would like to watch it. And we'll see you guys for that one. Enjoy, guys. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs>